Hi, welcome to another episode of I Am Trans News. I am your hostess as always, Novana Beta, and today I'm going to be talking to you about a Utah bill which would require trans girls to change their birth certificate before joining female high school sports, okay? So, um, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and read some of this article. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe. And here we go. A proposal coming before Utah lawmakers this year will require transgender teens to change their birth certificate and undergo hormonal therapy before competing in fe- and before competing in high school sports that align with their gender identities. The new measure is a follow-up to a failure bill from earlier this year that would have barred transgender girls from competing in female K through 12 sports. And while everyone from Governor Spencer Cox to Utah Jazz owner Ray Smith expressed concerns about that previous plan, the new version was presented Wednesday to a legislative committee with far less controversy. It says here, uh, Senator Rep Berkeley, a bill senator, said to committee her draft legislation states that Generally, high school students can only join in a gender-specific sport that matches with their birth certificate. Teams who change their birth certificate sex designation from M to F must also go through at least a year of hormone therapy before participating in girls' athletics, according to the bill. Treatment received prior to the certificate change counts towards the one-year requirement. Transgender boys taking testosterone as part of their transition can compete in male-designated sports, but not in female athletics, the bill states. The girls can participate in a boys' sport if their school doesn't offer that activity to female students. Okay, it says here, uh, Susan Robbins who is the chair of the Transgender uh, Adversity, Adversary, Advisory uh, Council for Equality, Utah said that there has been a great progress on the proposal over the last few months and that Brooklyn currently current version offers a workable work frame. Um, and they're talking about it, basically. Let's see. Let me go down here. Um... I'm just looking to see if there's anything else. <laughs> Basically, that's it. So, um, yeah, what do you think about this? Do you think that this is right? Do you think this is cool? That um, I think it's cool that this discussion is even being had, that people are being open and willing to at least talk about it and give trans teenagers and younger kids in elementary school a chance to transition and have um and have a good childhood the childhood that they desire and you know have to go through some adversities you know more than likely but at least they will be living the life that they want to live and it's just really an amazing thing to see um especially you know i'm an 80s baby so it's like i was part of that older you know older crowd when it was still really bad so it's just an amazing thing to see so let me know what y'all think about this um topic in the comment section below make sure you hit the like button make sure you subscribe hit the notification bell so that you're alerted to the other videos that i'm going to be posting and as always i am novana beta and this is i am trans news